night. Only on two, it's a moldy mess infesting a vacant south suburban condo now wreaking havoc on the neighbor upstairs. CBS 2 investigator Megan Hickey got a look at the rotting residents and Megan, this neighbor claims a whole problem could have been avoided. Right, Erica Vivian Sanders pipes burst over the weekend plumbing plumbers telling her it's because of that vacant condo beneath her. She says she's been making calls about the filthy conditions there for years, but nothing was ever done. I have no water. Did you turn this thing on? I have no water. That's it right there. Four days with no water. With no water. That's it. I have no water in the sink. Vivian Sanders has had it. She's lived in this Country Club Hills condo for 27 years, and it wasn't until her downstairs neighbor up and left a few years ago that she started having problems. I started smelling things that didn't smell quite so right. The door was wide open today when we checked it out. This is unbelievable to me, the amount of mold that I am seeing. That back wall back there, that's my unit on the other side of that wall. I mean, it's covered. Covered, completely covered. The carpet used to be beige. Now it's covered with what looks like green moss. Cobwebs are frozen to the door and dark mold coats the walls. And I'm always telling them the source of the problem is on the first floor. Please go in there. And they could not get in there, would not go in there. A spokesperson for the city of Country Club Hills tells me the building department deemed it unfit for occupancy, but they tell me they're waiting on Sanders Homeowners Association to begin repairs. A spokesperson for the association told me they've been trying unsuccessfully to contact the owner of the moldy unit, HHS Marketing LLC. We tried to find them too. Welcome to Verizon Wireless. Your call can now be completed as dialed. Also with no luck. Today, the association told me they're taking every step possible, saying they couldn't get involved until it impacted one of their condos. No water. No water whatsoever. This is the association again. Vivian's yeah. neighbor, Tanya Pace, worries her condo will lose water next. I'm horrified. And they're both worried about their health. All the places that I go to tell me that their hands are tied. Then who needs to untie these hands? Someone needs to answer my question. Now, both